Hello, and thank you for listening to our mindful recording on breathwork. For more information on our mindfulness resources, please visit our Counseling Center Texas State website, and please look for the Learn to Know the Now landing page. You can always go back to that landing page on our website to inquire on any future resources or events that we have regarding mindfulness. And so with today, as I mentioned earlier, we're going to be reviewing the topic of breathwork. And so breath work is a bit different than respiration. As we know, we all require respiration to breathe on during our everyday lives. However, with breath work, we're taking a little bit more intention on our breaths and the intervals as far as our breathing in the moment. And so with breath work, we're first going to cover, um, you know, how to do it properly. And so, yes, there is a you know, incorrect way of doing it. Um, you know, I describe it as, you know, with our breath work, we want to make sure that it's most efficient when we need it in the moment. And so the first thing we're going to do, I'm going to invite you to uh, find somewhere comfortable uh, to sit, um, you know, having a good private place where it might be a bit quiet could also be helpful as well. And the first thing you're going to do is you're going to place one hand on your upper chest, and then your other hand right on your lower abdomen. And so for this first time, we're just gonna practice and I'm going to instruct you to take a deep breath for four seconds. So when you're ready, go ahead and inhale. One, two, three, four, and slowly exhale. And pay attention to what you noticed. And so what we're trying to do when it comes to our deep breaths is to maintain the inhale and exhale of our lower abdomen while our chest stays still. So if you notice during that practice round that your chest really popped out, we really want to focus on trying to maintain that and keeping that still as possible. If it moves a little bit, that's okay. But what we really want is the inhale and exhale of our lower abdomen. That's how we truly know we're getting those deep diaphragmatic breathings. And so when we do that, we're actually communicating to our nervous system that it's okay in the moment, that there's no need to be anxious or stress, and that we can also calm down, increase some calmness and peacefulness in the moment. And that's the main goal of breath work is to increase that sense of peace in the moment, but also it could be effective as far as improving concentration and focus as well. Because as you can imagine, we're probably a bit more centered and focused in the moment if we are calm versus if we're maybe stressed or anxious about an exam. So as you reflect on your first practice round, uh, this time, I'm actually going to walk you through an exercise. And so we're going to go a few rounds. And during the rounds, again, notice the inhale and exhale of your lower abdomen and really trying to maintain uh, stillness within your upper chest. If you still feel your chest popping out, that's okay. Again, just remain centered and try to move your focus back to your lower abdomen where you're doing these deep breaths. And so for this exercise, you could do it anywhere at any time. Again, having a place where it's calm and quiet could you know, be more beneficial. And so for this exercise, what we're going to do is we're going to inhale for four seconds, hold it for two, and then slowly exhale for four seconds. And so I'm going to count out for you. And as before, again, find a place where you can sit down comfortably. And we'll begin in a second. Remember to have one hand on your upper chest and the lower other one on your lower abdomen. So go ahead and inhale through your nose. One, two, three, four. Hold it, one, two, now slowly exhale through your mouth, one, 
two, three, four. Again, inhale, one, two, three, four, hold, one, two, and slowly exhale through your mouth, four, three, two, one. Again, inhale, one, two, three, four, hold, one, two, and slowly exhale, four, three, two, one. All righty, and when you're ready, you can open up your eyes and really reflect on how that experience was for you. Again, with any skill, it takes practice for it to be most efficient. Um, and so I would recommend, you know, maybe giving this a go either right when you wake up in your morning or maybe including it in your bedtime routine at night. And so again, thank you for joining our mindful recording. As always, for more information, check out our Learn to Know the Now web page through our Texas State Counseling Center website for more information on events and resources. Thank you and have a good rest of your day. Take care.